it's gardening season, perfect time to grow your veggies. And I had a little issue because I had so many little insects around my strawberries that are are coming into bloom now. And they were completely infesting my back garden. Um, So I decided to make my own insect repellent for the season. And I thought I'd give you guys a little show how I do it. So right there, I got some neem oil. This is perfect. And the main thing you need to use if you want to repel any insects or pests that are eating anything in your garden or just causing a disturbance overall. Um, You have to use very small amounts of it, less than a teaspoon per one liter of water. Um, I also added some chili, chili powder, like a very, very small amount, as you can see there. This is this is half a teaspoon. As you can see, I'm using less than half of a teaspoon in that little in the bottle of water I have there. And I'm going to add some water to that. I'm going to shake it about and I'm going to use it on my plants. This is much better than any insect repellent you can buy in the supermarket that will absolutely put all kinds of pesticides and nasties in your food. That obviously, the, that's the whole point why you're growing at home is because you're trying to avoid those nasties going in your food. So this right here is completely safe and natural. Neem oil is only toxic in extremely high amounts. Uh, you, you know, your kids, your your dog, they, they can smell it. They can, you know, it's, it's not going to kill them is the best way to put it. Uh, and it's completely safe. Insects absolutely hate it. The plants, they grow naturally with it. They have no issues at all. And I highly advise you guys using it if you're planning on growing anything this season. And yeah, I can do an update video in the future. Follow for more Knowledge is Power.